What's up you guys? Welcome back to the channel. It's been a heck of a hot minute since our last Amazon legging haul. Under 20 that is, obviously, okay? We're all on a budget here. So today I'm coming at you with an Amazon legging haul. Seamless, of course, edition. Under 20 for each legging. That's what I'm talking about. Affordable AF. <laughs> so the absolute fun part about this video is getting to test them out for you guys, all right? Testing out to see if they're either a home run or a major freaking strikeout. Could be one or the other, we don't know. And I'm not gonna lie, I already tested these leggings out. I got a little bit of both here. Some I'm like, okay, some I'm like, the frick. Also a huge thank you to Just CBD for sponsoring today's video. They have an amazing assortment of premium CBD products. Me personally, I love their new vegan gummies, guys. You've seen me talk about them nonstop and I'm still gonna mention them. I freaking love them. I will have them linked below for you and if you do see something you like, feel free to use my code Ashley to save 20% off your entire order, baby. So let's go ahead and get into this video, and if you're not already, definitely hit that subscribe button so you don't miss videos like this, baby. Feel free to follow me on Instagram as well for all things fitness, because together, we got this, yeah. All right guys, so I bought my true size and everything you see today, which is a size small, right? That's my true true, my true blue size. So we about to see um, how things freaking fit up in here. My measurements are down below for you to reference and everything you see today is also linked in case you wanna take a closer look for yourself, girl. So without further ado, let's dip and dive into this, shall we? These are all seamless, these are all high-waisted and they are all four-way stretch so you do have like baby gussets, about that big. Nothing crazy, about that big. We got first up, baby. <laughs> <laughs> from the brand Udota. I ain't that good at pronouncing things as it is, so just bear with me with the names, okay? Udota, we got a high-waisted, seamless red legging. Ooh, we on fire today. This baby came in at $16.99, the most affordable legging you're gonna see in this haul, mind you. First things first, although it's labeled as red, looking at it right here right now in natural daylight, I would give it more of a like, Pinkish vibe, super light, almost pink. That's what I'm gonna go with. We got Marl up on this here bad boy and lots of contour, lots of movement, specifically around the, right where I want it, just so you know, okay? So we're off to a decent start. It has a glorious scrunch butt, but we gotta talk about that scrunch butt real quick. So here's the thing. The actual scrunch butt goes from the band all the way down to the gusset. It's not a tiny scrunch. It's a full on straight up highway. At first I was like, what the actual? But when I put them on, I literally like couldn't believe it. I, I was shocked to see my own glutes look the way they did. So a few things though, the actual scrunch itself is not really stretchy. <laughs> so it feels like something's kind of riding up there a little bit. But damn, if it don't make them shizzes look good though. Oh, I want to make note that I got to I just got to size up in this. It was a little too tight. I literally had to get on the floor to put these on. I somehow made it happen. I don't know how. Okay, Bay was watching me laughing. Ha ha, Bay. <laughs> yeah, so it was a little bit of a struggle. Totally size up. With that being said, me squatting in it wasn't the most comfortable thing in the world. The band though, I have to say, I do like the band. It's pretty thick actually. It's more thick than your actual like normal four inch. I believe it's more like a four and a half inch. So a little bit bigger, ribbed band. No dreaded CT in this one. Can you believe it with how tight it was on me? It wasn't giving me a freaking frontal hump if you know what I'm saying. Mm. If you look on the back of these leggings, without me wearing them, look at how the boote takes kind of come out with extra baggy material. You see how it does that? To allow room, extra little material for the cheeks. I thought that was really great. They know not to slam in the cheeks and make you look like freaking flat pancakes. It is awesome minus the fact that it feels like somebody's taking a floss and just kind of flossing in places I don't really want. I really wish they made this scrunch a little more stretchy to stretch with your body a little bit. 
But I do have to say, they come in at a 24 inch inseam, so a perfect length on me being five foot three, ooh wee. It, it really is an overall beautiful legging, and I can't stress enough how I literally saw my glutes in a light that I've never seen them before, which means they actually looked good for once. The material is 66% nylon, 14% spandex, and 20% polyester okay so they're not like buttery soft by any means they still got that slightly ruggedness but nevertheless they are wicking i've not worn them to the gym obviously i pretty much just got these babies in <laughs> but just from first impression they have a little bit of a stretch but they need to be sized up i have to size up in these all right guys next up from the brand success success the gray leggings that are literally identical to the ones that you just saw except better freaking quality and true to size. So these are a little bit more pricier. They roll in at $19.95, so only a few bucks more. But I gotta say, to me, it's worth it. Cause you get your true size and not for nothing, just by feeling it, this is a little bit thicker. So you can tell it's not as thin, okay? Fragile as the other ones. This one's a little more, got that little thicky thicky that I like, okay? These may last you longer, so keep that in mind. A few extra bucks goes a long way, apparently, on Amazon. So the band on these babies are a little bit shorter than the other ones you just saw. So these are a three and a half inch band, okay? So if you kind of prefer a smaller band, you can go with these. But nevertheless, everything else is the same. The booty contour that kind of hugs in, it's a little bit of a compressive booty contour, kind of perks the bum up. And you still have that same exact highway, that's what I'm gonna call it, highway scrunch butt. Um, again, it's not really that elastic, so even with a true size, when I bend down low into a squat, I could feel an ever so slight like tuggy pull. I feel like if I were to really do something crazy in these, I might just split right down the middle. I don't know, but that's the feeling I get. So I think that's the only downfall to these leggings. Other than that, oh my freaking God, girl, it's glutination. It literally separates the two buttocks away from each other and literally gives you the best curvature I've ever seen in my entire life. It is like Moses parting the sea up in here. I swear to God, when I see girls on Instagram where the like leggings just ride up the whole thing i don't know how it's possible perhaps they're wearing these amazon leggings <laughs> but yeah other than that everything is pretty much the same as the leggings you just saw this is made out of 78 percent nylon and 22 percent elastane so um there's no polyester in this i i don't think that really makes a freaking difference this feels a little bit better than the ones you just saw and to be honest a little bit more stretchy so these are a definite go and the plus about this legging and the other one is that they're both freaking squat proof so for under 20 squat proof holy grail bum leggings yes i would say the only downfall is the scrunch needs to be more stretchy and then these would be freaking top tier in my opinion dang Dang! P.S. This particular brand of legging has a lot more color options than just this gray. I only went with gray to mix up the colors, but you best believe that I wanna try some bright colors, girl. This also does not give me the dreaded camel toe. So overall, if you wanna spend a couple more bucks to know you're getting your true size and a little bit higher quality, it's definitely worth it, definitely. All right, now we're getting to some vibrancy right now are you ready man you want to see some summer vibes here we go okay so this is from the brand sataya okay and i paid 17.99 for these leggings but literally right before i filmed this video i looked up just to make sure i had like the material and everything correct and they upped the freaking price to 23.99 i'm gonna tell you right here right now i was mad that i even spent 17.99 so do you remember in the beginning of the video when I said we had some home runs and some strikeouts? Strike number one, baby. So first and foremost, the color is beautiful. Let's not get it twisted up in here. This was completely obviously inspired by Gymshark's Vital Seamless. It looks almost identical, except that these dotted contours are a little more emphasized. There's a lot more of them too, but everything else pretty much looks the same. You got that same tone of green that sour pistachio they came out with, with a couple years ago that I'm obsessed with. Yeah, so this is the same deal. You totally have to size down in these. They had a little more of that extra baggy material. So um, right off the bat, it's definitely like lower compression 
to moderate at best, but definitely lower side. So don't get it twisted, man. Just because it looked like the vital don't mean it got high impact, okay? This ain't high impact. <laughs> or high quality for that matter. I'm gonna be honest with you guys, it's not even like really close to squat proof. I think on their description, they said it was like 70 to 80% squat proof, but me personally, my opinion, I would give it more like 50% squat proof. So I pretty much saw everything through this. <laughs> and uh, hey, what do you, what do you, you know, what are you gonna do? But for over 20 bucks now, there's not really much I could do with this thing. <laughs> what can I do, girl? I mean, I have more success making a bandeau out of it. You know what I'm saying, girl? No, but for real. It's a four inch band, standard. 25 inch inseam, not too, too bad, you know what I mean? It's still okay and acceptable for me. And you still have that signature raised seam contour down the middle of the back. But um, it's just not working for me at all. I'm sorry, I went from those leggings where it literally showed my peach looking like a real peach. And then I went to this and it just like, it just like laid over me. <laughs> just like laid over my body. So um, eh, it's a lot softer than the other ones. I will give it that. It is 65% nylon, 25% polyester, and 10% spandex. So it does feel a little bit softer, but nothing crazy. They are very, very, very thin leggings. You can feel it. Like I feel like over time I, I might slip up. I might poke a hole through these babies. I just don't know. Why are you raising the price though? It does give me a slight camel toe, but I think it's just because of the overall thinness of the material. All right guys, so last legging we got here today is from the brand Fit2. Rolling in at $19.99. Still not 20 yet though. This is in the color Smiling Booty Navy. I will give it to them. It is a smiling booty. You got a freaking smiley face contour booty. I'm gonna be real with you. Looking at them, I said, holy shiz. They look like navigation leggings, right? I always wanted to try navigation. I never have, because they're always freaking sold out when I go to buy anything, but always wanted to. So I said, ooh, we got a little similarity here. It was misleading. <laughs> the picture on their site, it pretty much was like the same as the navigation, you know? That whole pose, the signature pose where you're, the glutes just be popping, everything be looking real fine and divine. Well, um, this gave me a freaking pancake ass. <laughs> Definitely out of the bunch so far. I think this was the one I kind of saved the shiestiest for last. The contour is really nice. The color is very beautiful. It's a nice marl breakup. Definitely too big though. It had a baggy look, so I would have to size down to an extra small if I ever wanted to retry these again. But here's the thing is there was no divide down the uh, the booty. Not even, not even a little bit. And girl, I gotta be honest with you. like. I forgot what it's like to wear a legging that doesn't have some kind of help where I need that help. So the fact that I tried a legging without it, my confidence. <laughs> so, um, mad discouraging. Like I took them off pretty much right away. Okay, you can see, I'm twitching. And that Amazon picture they used, it misled me so much. I really had high hopes. Like I thought this was gonna be it, the grand slam of them, but not so much. So these were a little bit long on me too. About 26 inch inseam. They gave me the slight camel toe, but I gotta give it to them. They were squat proof, okay? So maybe if I sized it down, they'd be all right, but nothing in this world will be acceptable about a uni but I can't do it I just can't I'm sorry like leggings should be working for you and your favor like that girl and if they're not okay if they are not doing that for you and working for you you spend money on them leggings then what the frig you shouldn't have to work for the leggings no these are a four inch waistband they are very low to moderate compression and there's no material listed that I could find so um I feel like they got that slight little ruggedness to them. They're not buttery soft or anything like that. So not the end of the world. They're just probably your basic material. And I really do love the contour, those swoopy doopy lines and the bo under booty contour is, is beautiful. They just didn't live up to um, what I thought or what the picture made it seem, but it's okay. This is why we do videos like this so that we could share and have girl talk. 
okay? It's freaking Amazon. You never know what you'd be getting. All right, guys, so that concludes another Amazon Seamless Under 20 haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and most importantly found it helpful. Amazon can be a big black hole of uncertainty sometimes. <laughs> so videos like this, I just hope they can help you make informed purchases. But these are all just my very own opinions, of course, every single time. So take it for what it's worth. And definitely comment down below if you've ever tried any of these brands for yourself. I want to know what your thoughts are on these leggings. And if there's any Amazon leggings that you swear by, that you want me to go over or anything like that, comment down below, okay? So I can get ready for my next Amazon legging haul. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll catch you in my next video.